We want to bring in our attorney, Jonathan Lavoy, who has been providing context throughout this trial with us. So go ahead. So I want to ask this question. We've been fighting over who would ask the first question, <laughs> Jonathan. Today we listened to this debate over whether or not Rose, uh, Rosenbaum was lunging or falling when he was shot by Rittenhouse. Why does that matter? Well, it's, it's amazing, guys, that we have that we're all watching the same videos, but depending on who you ask, um, some people believe he was lunging and some people are saying he was falling. It matters because if you believe the prosecution side of the story, that he was falling away after being shot. But if you believe the defense uh, position, he was lunging at the gun, which supports self-defense. So we see um, each side taking a different uh, opinion as to what that video really shows. So Jonathan, you mentioned the gun. Jurors today got to see the actual AR-15 rifle used in the shootings and a demonstration from a Kenosha detective, including the prosecutor asking the detective at one point to point the weapon at him. Why such a dramatic moment? I, I thought that was that was something and I, I thought the judge was a little bit uh, nervous about that happening too. They, they normally don't point weapons in court, but I think that the prosecution was trying to make a point and trying to show the angles of what was happening. And I think he was trying to show um, just the, 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 the power of this weapon and was, was trying to show the jury sort of what was happening during the shooting. All right, do you think that all signs are po pointing to closing arguments by the end of this week? I do, I think that it's moving exactly what the, the parties thought it, it would, would, would go. I think that the defense right now is doing some cleanup work and I think that pretty soon we're gonna see the testimony of, of Mr. Rittenhouse. And I think after that, um, the trial is gonna conclude pretty quickly. So I think it's gonna be over this week. All right, Jonathan, we will stay with you all week. We appreciate your insight. Jonathan will be joining us every night at six o'clock during the trial to provide his expert analysis of the day's proceedings and testimony. And of course, you can always stay connected online. We will be posting breaking and continuing coverage of this trial. Simply go to TMJ4.com slash Rittenhouse.